You see, what man can be, he must be. And if you are planning on being anything less than what you're capable of, you're going to be unhappy. So make this the year where you decide to just get better. This is the year that I get crystal clear on my values. Commit to doing the things that you knew you should have been doing last year. This year, don't settle for good enough. I want you to stop looking towards tomorrow, next week, next month, next year, and start looking towards where you need to be right now. This is the year that I make an investment in myself. Are you ready for more in 2024? This is the year I give it everything I have. This is the year I stop complaining about the past. This is the year that I don't make excuses. This is the year that I embrace my non-negotiables. This is the year that if I see it in my head, I can hold it in my hand. All you gotta do is be prepared with the right mindset and just let it come in. It is possible to accomplish what you see in your head, to hold it in your hand. It is possible. The question is, can you give your all? You have to continue down that path, that journey, that year, that moment, that right now. 2024 is knocking on your door. You got to go all in. I'm all in! I'm all in! Are you all in? Look, a great life. It doesn't happen by chance. It happens by design. And the best way to design that is to just get started. Say it with me. Come on. Just get started. This year, you got to maximize every moment. This year, you've got to crush every opportunity you get. This year, you've got to be all in. You need to learn the lessons of your mistakes. Forgive yourself and forgive others so you can move forward. You've got a luminous, brilliant, powerful future. It's time to step into it. Because the challenge that we all face is the challenge of choice. If you genuinely took a minute and thought about all the choices that you could make, but the choices that you could make and the choices you will make, that is where the magic is. The magic that human beings have is in our ability to overcome what we face. And this could be the year. In fact, no, this will be the year where you become more by what you overcome. It's time to break through the disempowering limited belief systems that we've carried our whole life. There was a future that I desired. I believe in the power of my future. And as much as life has tried to amputate my spirit, I refuse to go down. I refuse to stop here. I refuse to let go. I refuse to give in. I refuse to keep living at 50%. The year 2024, once again, you made it. You went through all of the struggles, all of the challenges. There are things that you have overcome. People have neglected you. People have overlooked you. People have underrated you and you overcame it. Life has hit you as hard as it could and you're still alive. But you can't allow your past mistakes to define you. Listen, just because things didn't turn out the way you wanted them to the last time, doesn't mean that things won't work out in your favor this time. If you're gonna remember anything from the past, remember how you overcame something. Being all in means your days of playing small are over. If you're really all in, you can't just dip your toe in the water. You have to dive in. You must be willing to submerge yourself in the thing that you say you want. Just understand that you got to go all in. Give everything you got within yourself. Give all or give nothing. This is my year that I give everything I have. Don't you want to feel what it's like to actually live? Feel what it's like to actually be happy and cheerful every day? 
Feel what it's like to wake up with a smile on your face when you look in the mirror. Feel peace in your heart when you open up your bank account. Feel happy when you are present and focused with your family instead of anxious and overwhelmed. Well, if you do, you gotta make a choice. And the choice is simple. Stop lying to yourself. Stop lying to yourself as to this next year is going to be the year you transform and make the transformation now. The year that you realize that you have a blessing. I'm putting it all in. I'm putting it all on the line. I'm not afraid of rejection. I'm not afraid of failure. I'm giving it everything I have. I'm all in. I'm all in. Are you all in? I'm all in. What you are going after is not for the weak. You have what it takes, but you have to believe it. You have to believe it. Nobody else can do that for you. You can't keep starting and stopping. You can't keep second guessing yourself. You've got to be committed to the process. And most of all, You've got to be committed to yourself. You see, everything in life exists for one reason. Every single cell lives to grow and express itself fully. But anything that grows goes up against resistance. You see, success only comes to those who put in the work every day regardless of how they feel regardless of what is going on around them regardless of not having the motivation and regardless of not knowing what direction to head we have conditioned ourselves to give 50 percent 60 percent we have normalized not putting all in we have normalized not giving something our all why because we're afraid we're going to lose because we're afraid we're going to be rejected because we're afraid we're going to give our all and it still won't be enough the time is now and you must endure and you must push and you must fight and you must believe that you got what you need inside of yourself don't waste it spend more time with people that believe in your dream spend more time with people that are life-giving and life-changing Football, baseball, basketball, soccer, the list goes on. Every sport is won by inches. And ladies and gentlemen, every sport is won by inches. Let me remind you of something. In every sport, in every sport, in every arena, in every court, every playground, you win by inches. Life is won. You gotta see the inches. You are inches away from the best life that you have ever had. See! the opportunity.